obviously a tough result today. How are you feeling giving it out to? Yeah, tough result. Um, I thought we started okay. Our, our first half, our pressure was right up there. But at the end of the day, that's um, the team that won the grand final last year against the team that finished last in 18 teams in the comp and only 10 games. How we play that team is beyond me. That's what you get when you get fixed in like that. And in that first half, like you said before, you've been looking for those little games. In that first half, you showed those little games that you picked up during the year? Yeah, had little had little wins uh, around the footy. I thought um, we were pretty good around the footy with our pressure, um, but that dropped away after half time. So we got to be able to sustain it. I thought we did it for one quarter last last week, two quarters this week, but doesn't win any any games of footy. Um, do you think the heat had any impact in the afternoon today? Well, it probably does, but both sides played in it and they dealt with it better than what we did. Sound frustrating. Why hold that six string? Could you expand on? Well, I just, yeah, it's, it's frustrating because I just think that there's 10, 10 games, 18 teams, and the side that won it is playing the side that come last. I just don't understand that part of it, uh, and we need to look at it. As far as measuring up against them, how, I guess, do you feel your club's progressing towards sort of being at that point that you want to be at eventually? Oh, I think we've got a lot of work to do. Um, we're miles away from where we want to be, that's clear. Um, but. We just look for little wins along the way and, and improvement in some of our players. And we had some good players today, like a couple of our younger girls again today, Ella Roberts, um, Charlie Thomas down back, were outstanding. So um, we just look for little wins like that along the way. Um, and I think, you know, girls, those young girls that can do it against a quality outfit like Melbourne, we've got to be, you know, happy with that. But, gee, we need a lot more girls to come along for the ride. Probably the sort of hard game to judge your, your backs based on the, the weight of entries that they're up against. Was it a, a draining game for them to be involved? Yeah, it's tough on our backs. I think they had um, three marks inside their forward 50 in the, in the first half, which is really good. Um, thought we defended well. And then the second half is a completely different story. So they had 19 marks inside their forward 50 in the second half. And I thought our backs really fell away with their defensive pressure. Um, but we're also getting done around stoppages and it was walking out of there, out the front door. So that makes it really hard for our backs to defend that. And with skill execution, it seemed to, I mean, the conditions, we didn't play a game of footy out in that sort of conditions, but skill execution at times seemed to let you down. How yeah. How you that aspect? Yeah, we, we thought we gave it back to them a lot, and we, but we identified one thing um, at half time what was working for us with our ball movement. We asked for more of that, and we and we didn't get it. So that's disappointing in itself. So um, we need to learn from those errors and and figure out what's working for us and and roll with it more often than than we did today. And how do you address this result with the group now? That's a, another big loss for the season. How do you keep them inspired for these last few games? Yeah, it's really tough. It's really tough because um, you know we thought we were right in the game at half time and drop away we did to, to keep the group up. We still got three games to go. We still got a couple of games in there that I believe we can do really well in. So um, you know I can try and motivate the group as much as I, I can and I will. Um, but a bit of it is on the players about self pride and, and how they want to finish the season off as well. So um, we'll keep them up and about, and um, they're pretty good, pretty resilient bunch. But um, they got to drive a lot of it themselves as well. And like you said, a couple of youngsters again stood up. Ella was good today, Charlotte as well. Ella had some time in the middle. Was that something you would do a bit more going forward? Yeah, I, I think she had probably a little bit more time than what she has, but she's played midfield forward all year for us. Um, maybe today it was just a little bit more than, than what she has done in the past. But um, yeah, in and around the ball, she's, she's pretty good.